Having this true curiosity on the Randy Show. I want to ask you a question. Why does it hurt so much when you're whacked in the balls? <laughs> yes, so it is because those structures are totally unprotected. For example, if I punch on your face, you have a layer of fat which causes a compression and reduces the the impact like a cushion. Like a cushion. Hmm. Wherever you have a fat every damn place except balls. Yeah. And they are hanging. Hmm. The second thing is they are hanging. So when you are hit there, they're totally unprotected and they are pulled. So there is a pull. So even if somebody pulls the ball, it causes pain. Yeah. Even if it is not being hit, even if there is not too much of a trauma, it is just gentle pulling will cause pain. But what causes that pain that shoots up to your stomach? Because testes are born with the kidneys. The blood supply and the nerve supply of the kidney of the testes is the same as that of the kidneys, and kidneys are in the middle of the in, in the upper part of the stomach. So, the place where the thorax or the chest cavity and the abdomen meet that is called diaphragm. So, kidneys are located just below the diaphragm, and the blood supply of the uh, of the testes also come from the same part of the artery. So, the nerves also go there. The lymph also goes there. So, if you are hit in the testes, your pain is felt in the abdomen. Yeah, you know the worst thing about getting hit in the balls, and all boys have been hit in the balls at some point in their life. The worst thing is that it's explosive pain when it happens, and then it's lingering pain for like ten, fifteen minutes in your stomach after. Yeah, it's one of the weirdest forms of pain you'll ever feel. Uh, so it's effectively that that whole nervous pathway is getting yeah a pain signal. Yes, yes. Do you get a lot of ball related problems? Because we yeah, we so do. We talk so much about penis but very little about ball. Something like torsion of testes which Twisting. happens torsion. So this happens in young men where you know even if they are sitting or they are not having any sexual thoughts their testes are like this that they can just twist. So normally testes should not be able to twist because there is a system there, but then there are developmental variations. We call them bell clapper deformity. So unless the testis rotates 270 degrees, uh, no, sorry, 200 half times, unless it rotates two and a half times, its blood supply doesn't get cut. But then if it goes up to two and a half times, then the testis dies off because of lack of blood supply. Oh, God. Oh. And this happens suddenly. So a person has a pain while he's in sleep or he's sitting or doing anything and he suddenly has a pain. And if the person doesn't reach a urologist within six hours and derotate the testis, the testis dies. And then kachak. You snip it off and you're just left with one ball. No, then what I do is I put a plastic ball inside. So that at least the partner <laughs> shouldn't understand. She may not keep telling him that, look, I've got a defective piece or a suboptimal piece. If you enjoyed this clip from The Ranveer Show, we've uploaded a ton of other clips related to a ton of other topics. So explore the channel because there's something for everyone.